Welcome back to No Man's Land. Well, I believe we're up to episode 18. And jobs today are to fertilise these two fields, which are now germinated. Uh, so we might just get that underway. Looks like we've got quite a few wool bales over there, so we better keep the productions going. Let's just have a quick check. Um, still got some fabric. Uh, the water's all automatically done, so that's all right. Animals are uh, okay. Yep, animals are all right for the time being. So, we'll get into the, uh, the Messy Ferguson. Where is it? Ah, hiding over here behind the trees. Get into here. And get the fertilizer spread again. I'm not sure if we have any spare containers of fertilizer around. We may have. What's that one? Can't tell from here. It is fertilizer. I oh, know that's probably lime. No, don't want that. That's a trap. <laughs> well, that one before. Uh, there might be some over the other side of this field. Oops, didn't mean to drive all over the crop. But if there isn't any here, we'll have to go to the store and get some, of course. Yes, fertilizer. Don't think this will be enough to do both. Nineteen percent. Uh, we'll probably get one done anyway, at least. So we'll get this one started off on a worker, and meanwhile we'll go and get that uh, wool delivered to the spinnery right here. That started. Yep, all good. And straight over to this tractor. Uh, and that's what we want the trailer. Perfect. Getting a bit busy here to get that shed in before too long. Anyway, let's get this wall. Perfect. Not a lot there, but it will keep the production going for a little bit longer. And uh, get that tailor shop supplied with fabric. Uh, so the other thing I meant to do was set the output on the spinnery to deliver to the tailor shop. I believe we can do. So check that out in a second. It seems silly to deliver and it's just uh, right next door. Yep, further forward. Okay, so if we jump into productions, uh, storing, change output, selling, distributing, that's what we want. So the fabric will go straight to the tailor shop and they'll produce clothes out of the fabric. Too easy. Here we go, get this trailer taken back to the farm. Yeah, just drop this off in the shed. The old shed. Yes, we do need somewhere to store all this machinery. Um, what else do we need to do? Oh, I thought he'd uh, the worker had stopped. No, it's still going. So, in the meantime, what I wanted to do was just do a bit more landscaping work over this way. And I just thought of something else I needed to do as well. Um, and I need the Messy Ferguson for that. I was going to grab those uh, grass bales that are laying around over in the field there and uh, deliver them to the sheep, but we'll, we will do that. 
but the um, the Massey Ferguson is the one tractor with the attachments on it. The John Deere doesn't. So there's one bale there, and there's another one over behind the spinnery there somewhere, I believe. Okay, so if I set myself there, I just wanted to fix up this road a bit because our roads here have a gravel edge dirt. Well, dirt's the closest thing that looks like gravel in uh, in farming simulator. So I'll we'll just start over here at the beginning. Radio, and we need to get the round tool would probably be better and maybe about that size <music> That looks more like it. Almost. A bit more to do. I've got plenty more ideas to use around the roads and the, the general landscaping and around those industrial buildings as well. But it looks like the worker has finished or run out of fertiliser. One of the two. He hasn't run out of fertiliser, so that's good. Let's just see what sort of a job he did. Or she. No, I don't want the weather. I want the map. Thank you. Hmm, not a particularly great job. So, we shall have to finish that off. I think you missed where the fence was here. Along here and down this side and we should be right. Not right about missing little bits, but as long as the majority of it's done. And I'll switch tractors over. Let's just check that's all done. Yes, perfect. And we'll just um, leave that there. I can go out that way. No, I oh know. Shouldn't shouldn't drive through the crop, should I? Move up there and we'll grab the John Deere. Fantastic looking tractor. And we'll get that on the fertilizer and we'll get the messy over to pick up those bales. back at the sheep pasture and it took all that bale I must admit I'm quite surprised right, I'll take all of that one let's just have a quick look uh, food yeah still wasn't even full with a whole bale hmm, amazing okay and it took the whole of that one as well There be a lot of grass in those bales. Right, let's pipe that up here and let's just have a quick look at what the worker's doing. Where's he gone? Over there. Still got 10% left and let's check the field. Yep, doing pretty well. Okay, I'll just time lapse the rest of this. I'll see you when the field is done.
Okay, here we are back again, finishing off the field, which should be looking pretty good. There'll be both fields ready to go, fully fertilised, fully lined. Ready to produce two good crops. And let's have a quick look. Yep, beautiful. Right, we'll get this back over to the farmyard and got five percent left so not very much we'll just uh, dump that over here go down our new track which isn't probably wide enough only just we'll probably widen that at some point and down to our new wide gate which is certainly wide enough Okay, so we'll dump this, uh, let's see, somewhere over here in the middle. Uh, yeah, middle of the road, that'll be right. And we'll just put this off here. Okay, so just check on everything else. Make sure there's nothing more we need to do. Sheep are fine. Chickens will be fine for a while. Productions are going well. We don't have any clothes yet. No, not yet. So I think we can now move on to the next day. We've done all our jobs, kept up with everything. Fields are looking great. Everything's going well. Okay, we have 185,000. I don't think money will be an issue. So if I just stay about there, go into construction farmhouses. Now I should just be able to sell that. No, oh, and get 9,000 for it. Beautiful. Happy about that. Okay, so the farmhouse is going to go. Ah, yes. Before I get ahead of myself once again. We'd better buy land first. So it's uh, that one. Yes, it is. 85,000. Buy that. Perfect, still got 110 left. So now go back into construction, farmhouses, already in farmhouses, and just find the one that I want. I'm in sheds. I thought it didn't look right. Yeah, so that one's 35, this one's 55. I'm not quite sure one bigger. I don't really want the great big one. Uh, which is the front? Bit hard to tell. I think that's the back, that side. So that might be the front there. So if we position that about there. And we'll just do a little bit of landscaping Lovely. Let's just have a quick look. Uh, this is our new house. Uh, lovely. I think I got it around the right way too. Fantastic. I'm not quite sure why there's two trigger points there, but um, brilliant. 
So, a little bit of fun out of the way. Let's get back down to business and see what we need to do. Crops are coming along. They're fine. Yes, still about two or three stages from harvest time. Animals are getting a little bit low. And the sheep probably need some water. So I shall get on with doing that and I'll see you when the sheep are watered. Right yeah, that's the sheep. Newly watered. That's what they're going to take a whole tank for. Yep, close enough. And I just noticed we've got a whole pile of uh, wool pellets there. So I think we'll be to get them over to the uh, spinnery. Okay, that's the wool dropped off. Let's see if we have any clothing yet. Do we? Yes, we do. We do indeed. Mm. Sense for fashion. Sounds good. Now the big question is, how much are we going to get? Or clothing. Uh, I'm assuming it's down the bottom of fabric, no? Uh, hmm, did I miss it? Thanks, chocolate. Clothes, I oh, did miss it. Ooh, 16,000. Um, that's fairly good. But it's probably going up. It is going up. So we won't get that yet. We'll wait for that to build up a little bit more. And it'll be interesting to see what we get in total. I also noticed when I drove past, there's quite a few eggs there. Let's just check the price of eggs. Quickly and see if they're worth selling. No. I don't think so. No, we'll leave the eggs. We'll leave the eggs for next time. Now, the one more thing I wanted to do before we move on, because there's nothing much else left to do, was put our new shed in, which I forgot to do when I was just doing the other construction jobs. Um, so we want sheds. That looks like, ooh, that's almost going to be too big. Don't think we can fit that in. I can that way, but that's not much good. Um, oh, I can that way. A little bit of space behind. Just move around so I can see where it's going. No, doesn't like that now. Come on, you liked it a minute ago. Yeah, I reckon there. I reckon right there. And then we will uh, do some more landscaping. We'll do that um, in the dirt, which I can never find. There it is. How's that look? That looks pretty good. Ah, yes. Lovely. And a very good spot for it. I think we shall put the heart, oh, this is the tractor, 
Well, the tractor can go in there as well. No, the tractor can go in this one here, I think. This is the area where it uh, gets used the most. So we'll pop that one in there. But the uh, New Holland Harvester, that can go in the new shed. If I can get it there. Ooh, a bit tight. <laughs> a bit tight, but we got through. Of course, this track was going to be in the way, isn't it? Of course it is. We'll get this part out of the way. Let's pop it in here. It'll take a while to get everything sorted, but we'll get everything in its rightful place. Yeah, I don't think this is going to fit in there, to be honest. It's not, is it? Not with the uh, header on. Ah. Uh, not a different style of shed. Alright. That's okay, everything else can go in there. I'll probably um, get that equipment in there off camera. And we'll get all this stuff sorted out. So we're pretty much up to date with everything again. Just waiting on crops. Um, yeah, everything else is done. Animals are fine. So I think we'll move on to the next day. Uh, for which we have to go to our nice new house. Here it is. Lovely. It's even got satellite TV. Apart from spend the money. Do need a baler. That's the one thing I haven't got. Um, and now we've got 188,000. We should have a lot of eggs. Yes, we do. Has the price gone up enough? I doubt it. What are we up to? Uh, so two four is what we're after. One five, no, but it is going up. So let's see. What are we going to do now? I want to get this uh, moved out of the way. Yeah, I'll just leave this here till I sort out what machine is going where. We can just stay there. Uh, plenty more walls, so, oh, yes. <laughs> I just disconnected that and I need it right away. Now, baler. That's why we're here. Let's just have a look. I don't think 188,000 is going to be enough. Well, actually, it might be. Depends what we uh, what we want. I want a square baler. Um, That's one of the ones I was looking at, 153. Uh, we've got the New Holland, uh, 159, that does the same. Case is also a nice one. But I think we'll go the class. And I think we'll buy it. Yep.
Okay, that's the wool delivered. Let's just have a look and see how many pallets of fabric we have. Food. You know what? I'm going to sell them just to see how much money we get. Just because we can. Alright, this will be interesting. I'll see you when we're at the store. Radio, right we're at the store. It didn't take long. 36,000 for two pallets. Pretty happy about that. So, things are looking pretty good. Farm is growing. We've got more land. We've got to uh, buy another plot of land and make that end field there a bit bigger. And I might just park this right here. Probably be in the way. And we'll pop the tractor. Right in there. Look at that. Lovely. Well, I think that'll wrap it up for this episode. Um, I don't think the crops... No, the crops won't be ready next time. Uh, probably another two months before they're right. And then we can get that harvester in there. Um, and what else are we going to do? Buy more land. Keep expanding. That's the plan. Well, thanks very much for watching. hope you enjoyed this episode. And uh, if you do, uh, give me a like and consider subscribing to the channel. And I'll see you on the next one. Thank you. Bye.